Hey, what is going on guys? It's your boy Daryl around here. For today's video, I'm going to do a $100 budget challenge to spend on clearance section only at outlet stores here in Maryland. Yes, yes, you heard me, only on the clearance section. I'm not talking about those 30 to 50% bullshit sales that they offer you every day. I'm talking about items that have special price tags that these stores are trying to get rid of because they were from the last season collection. By the way, I do buy most of my items on clearance section, so this is nothing new for me. However, this time I have to see how many styles or outfits could I put together within a hundred dollars budget? With that being said, I want you guys to guess how many items I will be able to purchase and how many styles can I put together, all right? Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop talking now and let's go shopping. All right guys, now we are here at Tanger Outlet at National Harbor and today's challenge, you know, I'm gonna do the hundred dollars challenge and it's all gonna be in the clearance section. So we'll see how it goes, but before we start, let's put this math on. Just to give you guys an update, like I haven't found luck in any of my favorite store, um, just like J. Crew, Banana Republic, and all that stuff. I may have found something from Banana Republic and HM, but we'll see how it goes. Let's keep going. Guys, we finished our shopping for today. So, great walk, great deals for today, especially in Banana Republic. I think I pick up like six different items. Um, right now, we're just gonna go ahead and go home and see what we try, and just gonna get bubble tea. Let's go. And we are back in my studio, aka my parents' basement or man cave or whatever you want to call this. And I am so happy with my purchase today because. I got quite a lot of items that I pick up from my favorite stores within a hundred dollars budget. So let's check out the items I got and their prices and I can't wait to reveal the biggest deal or deal that I got. All right guys, so my first item here is from Calvin Klein, if I pronounced right. And this one right here is a white t-shirt, as you see me. And I got this one for $10, as you could see on a receipt. And for my second one, I got this jeans from Express. It's a slim, skinny, stretch jeans that I thought I got it for 20 bucks. But you know what? When you go in a clearance section, this is what you're gonna find out. A surprising discount. And I got this only for 10 bucks. So that's a good one too. All right, next one, we're gonna have the Banana Republic stuff. And I definitely bought a lot of items from them. So we're gonna go down the list and let's see What's my favorite one? All right guys, so I said I stopped by Banana Republic outlet store and I mentioned I, that I got a lot of stuff. And my first item that I got from them, and this one's called Rib Crew Neck Sweater. And I believe it's like an oatmeal color. I don't know if you guys see that. Oatmeal color. And I got this one for only six bucks or seven bucks. I guess six, seven and nine, make sure. Six, seven and nine. 
All right, and for my next one, I got this um, Tech Motion Skinny High Stretch. And this one, I tried this on in the fitting room and it's very comfortable. Fits my body and guess how much I got this for? I got this for about 17 bucks. Not bad for jeans, for well-fitting jeans, all right? Next one, I think this is one of my favorite pick from Banana Republic is a, what is it called? A French Terry uh, sweatshirt. It's a nice looking one. It's also, it's also in like an oatmeal or off-white color. I don't know how you guys said, but I got this one for 13, uh, $13.99. And my favorite deal or favorite steal that I got from Banana Republic is this, which if you guys are watching my videos that I normally wear this kind of stuff. It's a shawl cardigan sweater. And guess how much I got this one for? I'm just gonna show you guys the receipt. And if I get this right. Right there. $6.79. $6.79 for a sweater. For a good looking sweater. Not not the crap one that you normally see in the clearance section. So this is a good stuff for me. And the last two items that I picked up from Banana Republic are these um, flannel shirt, or they call it specifically a yarn dye shirt, untucked for 20 bucks. And the last item that I picked up from Banana Republic is called a Mason Athletic Taper Pant, or I'm just gonna call it a jogger, which is in navy blue. And I'm telling you, this is a comfortable one. And I only got this one for $15.99. And for my last item that I bought online, not outlet stores, okay? But it just came in through my mail, so I just gotta put it on the video too. It's from Nordstrom, but the brand is from Top Man. It's an oversized shirt. So I'm gonna show you guys how to style this. And that's about eight stylish items total under the $100 budget, in which I think it's a lot. Now, to sum up all the prices, the total will be, oops, I'm a little over 32 cents, but you guys could forgive me. Anyways, let's try them on and see how many outfits I could put together with these items. Let's get started. So that's all the outfits that I could combine together under $100 budget. That's about 15 to 20 outfits, which is almost a whole month of working days, which I am blown away, guys. I don't know about you guys, but I am blown away. And like I said, I have never done this before, so I am very happy to see the results. So which outfit did you like the most? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you happen to find this video interesting, please don't forget to press the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you happen to like the content in my channel. Well, that's it for me, guys. Have a good day, everyone. Stay safe, stay amazing. 
See you on the next one. Peace.